the incident of Dreamy Vale Church. Ooh, interesting. The incident of Dreamy Vale Church. My name is Mike Bay, aka Phone, and this is Indy for Breakfast. This game is available on the Xbox Live in the game market for 80 MSP. That's one dollar. Now, getting in here, uh, first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna look at the controls and whatnot. We're gonna kick the music down just a smidge. Uh, music test. Oh, hey. It's kind of cool. You go through and listen to all the music and whatnot. Now, uh, one of the first things you, gotta you guys are probably going to notice is that this game is loaded with boobs. Um, boobs, boobs, boobs. Just boobs, right? Uh, <laughs> and handcuffs, I suppose. Um, now, <laughs> all this stuff wasn't quite available in the trial, so uh, hopefully there are no actual boobs, in which case I might be in trouble. Um, but... You would typically think this would be something that would go on any for breakfast rejects, right? You would, because I mean, you know, it's usually whenever uh, there's some kind of uh, like an exploitative property or something like that, which in this case would be uh, vulgarity, I guess you could say, uh, like this. Um, <laughs> you would say, I'm trying to put this as PC as possible. Um, you you would immediately think that the rest of the game was just terrible. Now, my first impressions of the game was obviously, oh, really, giant like, CGI breasts. I'm sure this game is going to be fantastic, right? Um, I was a little surprised. Now, I've only played about five minutes of it. I don't really know what else is in store beyond like the first couple seconds. Uh, so I'm curious to see what happens later. Now, obviously, you see there's a story here. Uh, one evening at Dreamy Vale Police Station, Laura no Noble, Anna Solace on duty. Uh, ring, ring. There are strange noises and lights emanating from the church. Hello, Dream. Oh, I'm going the wrong order. There, thank God they're numbered. Uh, that's strange. Father Bartholomew is away this week. Okay, I'm on my way. Notice, there's a zoom button. Hey, that's kind of nice. This allows me just to look around. This is for people who, um, maybe you don't have your glasses and you need to be able to uh, see a little bit better. You need to just kind of, you know, zoom in a little bit so you can actually read the items on the screen. Uh, so we'll go next. Say, uh, there's some kind of disturbance at the church. I'm going to check it out. Okay, be careful. Radio if you need assistance. Yeah, I'm sure I'll be all right. I'm just probably some kids who will... Will scarper as soon as they see blue flashing lights. I hope it's nothing more than that. Of course, they have their their uh, RoboCop style future cars. And then what? I better bring my police baton just in case. Is she gonna pick it up with her feet? Oh no, she's getting into the driver's seat. Got it. <laughs> Figured like she was. Anyways, oh man. Next. Let's see. Minutes later, the gates to the church grounds. Uh, something's happening. Great. Oh my! It can't be. Skeletons everywhere. Look at that. skeletons everywhere. See, this is what the zoom's here for. So you can actually really get in there and take a look at stuff. Uh, get Do not let her escape. Back at the station. Why didn't she check in? Does that respond to any form of communication? Laura will come in. So, oh, so I'm not playing as the first person. I'm playing as the second person to come and inspect. Oh my gosh! Look at what is this nonsense? Huh? Oh, we're gonna we're we're now okay. So we've un unshackled her. Yep, they sneaked up behind me. Right. Okay. Oh, good. Right. Good. All right. So now we're in the game. This is the part where I was <laughs> slightly distracted, but also uh, quite impressed. This it's a beat 'em up that's actually done pretty well. Uh, it, yeah, it's actually designed. Pretty awesome. Like I, again, I was like, oh my god, this is any for breakfast reject. I cannot wait to put this out because this game is clearly gonna be terrible. Minus breasts, right? And that's it. Now I'm getting my ass kicked. Hold on a second. Oh my gosh, I, I'm been stomped. Holy crap. Okay, hold on. Did use my special. <laughs> But uh, again, you know, getting in here and, and playing it, I was just kind of like, holy crap, this thing is pretty awesome. Uh, let's see, come on. Yeah, they, you have tons of attacks. Here's your heavy attack, right? So light, light, oh, choke, throw. But it, it, it's very much Turtles in Time, for those who played the arcade. Oh, I think it's actually, you've been on uh, Xbox now. But still, it's, it's so much like that, it's ridiculous. Oh. oh god, ouch. Now you notice the credits too for start to join. Obviously they're going for the arcade beat em up style. Oh, we have a young lady skeleton in here. Damn.
Now, obviously, I've already died once. And I'm wondering if the tuning for the gameplay is not it is more designed for two players because again as I came through the first time I was also getting my ass handed to me. Hmm. Wow. Just charge right in there, guy. Top hat. Okay. Stands what are you doing? <laughs> he just like runs in and out of the screen. Oh no. Oh, he has he's covering his eyes as he's running. Yeah, continue. I don't know how many continues you get, but I'm definitely going to be using a lot of them. Because <laughs> I got to see what the story is here, right? Father Bar Bartholomew is gone, and all of a sudden, skeletons are everywhere. I'm willing to bet. I'm willing to bet Father Bartholomew is the one organizing this whole thing. He's some kind of strange necromancer, warlock, something demon thing. Uh, or he also became one of these things. One of the two. Oh, we have tons of dudes coming. <laughs> you can't I mean, you can't argue with it. It's it's so it's so well done for a one dollar beat em up. So well done. Most three dollar beat em ups aren't this good. Like who cares if she's running around with like double G's? I don't think that's a thing. One can only hope. Oh, who cares if she's running around with those things hanging out and they're you know French made outfit and all that stuff? It's like the the combat is great. I'm saying that as I'm getting my ass kicked, which means I mean it, guys. <laughs> That she's the worst. Just look at she's just bitch slapping me. That backhand, and then of course the backflip. Come on, that's enough. That's enough. Story time. Oh, the Y button's a little overpowered. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, but I can't use it constantly. Ah, look at that, it actually depletes my health. I did not know that until just now. That could be one of the reasons why I was getting my ass kicked so, so like, handily. <laughs> Using a sweet. what if I use a, an air attack? It does, huh. Good to know, none of my other abilities seem to do that. That's good. Stage clear. Uh, terribly, yeah, bad. Lives used. Is it depleting my score or is it giving me score for dying so many times? Uh, after the struggle with the side door at the other end of the church, you finally escape, finally, uh, f finale, escape back out into the fresh evening air. Thank goodness I got out of there in one piece. Oh no, not more. Let me through. I don't want to hurt you. See, she knows she's a crazy demon slayer. Well, I guess we haven't seen any demons yet. It's all been skeletons of some sort. Damn. So, okay, so it's like you gotta make the call. It's like, is it worth it to lose a little bit of health to go up against those who are constantly hitting you anyways? Because you're gonna lose health fighting them. Okay, can, can I grab one? Just grab one. Ah, bad. There we go. No, 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 I need to grab one of these guys and throw it at that girl. No! Right. Uh, oh, got that. I had him. Again, the game feels great. <laughs> I can't lie. It feels good. Oh, nice. <laughs> Let's just run towards the camera for 30 minutes. Any for breakfast, folks. Uh. Oh, damn. What did I just pick up? Continue. Yeah, continue. Oh, those shrooms. I can pick them up, huh? Top hat, just dick. Look at him, just charging constantly. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Money. Damn it! <laughs> Top hat, killing me. All right. Now I wonder. At any point, are we gonna get something other than skellies? And what does the money do? Yeah, 
him in. That was meant for her. There we go. Yeah, I'm in trouble. Yeah, I don't have enough health to do my special. Now I do. Clear all this stuff out easily. So you have so many different abilities. Let me see if I could just get the character up on the screen here. You can see. So I have like low kick, right? And then I have. Uh, oh, those both seem to do the same thing. Okay, that's good to know. Okay, good. So your left trigger and, and so your bumpers and your triggers do the same thing on either side, but they're two different things. So kick, heavy. So it's like heavy kick, heavy this and that. Um, then of course we have the that move which depletes health, but it does. I mean, it's obviously very OP. Uh, B button, standard kick. A button, jump light attack right so you combo stuff right jump kick jump kick uh jump hit i don't know besides flash her, her crotch at me i'm not entirely sure what that does i'm i'm actually very curious now what that does let's go find uh some more skeletons to use it on hmm i don't know Oh, it's like a stun of some sort. Money. Pretty sure the money, all that does is just gives me just points, score, that's it. Oh, damn. Now the shrooms are something I'm not certain of. So here I'm low in health. Pick it up. Oh, it's reversed my controls. Ouch. Okay, so each shroom does something different. That's this is now very difficult to. Okay, now it's returned. Interesting. So that means there are some kind of there are power ups. We just don't know what they do until we pick them up, I guess. Or the color will determine what they are. I wish I remember what color that was. I would have no problem. Uh, ignoring that particular shroom. Oh, damn it. Would you get him in a headlock? If the fuck, damn. Stupid Bogart. Headlock, headlock. There we go. Uh, see? Knee him in the nuts. Knee them in the nuts. Uh oh, boss fight time. Or it's more of these guys. Okay, grab one. Throw him in the crowd. Punch the other. Heavy attack. Heavy attack. Giant spinning kick. I'm gonna die. There it is. Oh, game over completely. No. The I, don't, of I don't get unlimited freaking. No, it sucks. Did I get any more pictures unlocked? No, that sucks too. That's just fun raising fancy dress costume. We'll go to this one. Uh, oh man, it's terrible. Oh, that sucks. Well. So far, all, all we fought are skellies. Let me do this. Let me look at the images on, on online. Every image is is skellies. So it makes me wonder: is this, is all this game has to offer? It's just fight fight skeletons. In which case, it's it's difficult to really recommend the game at all. Uh, but it's a it's a solid freaking beat 'em up, man. Like it actually works, and it's well done. There's grabs, there's throws. Let's see, grab. Knee in the nuts, grab, knee in the nuts, throw, right? Uh, gra grab, reverse throw. Well, not quite a reverse, but see, push another move here. I'm trying to see if anything else does anything. Just knee him in the nuts, he's dead. <laughs> but there, yeah, there's impact there, so like you throw, you pick him up. Okay, come on, give me. come on, come on, come on. There you go. And then I can throw them at another character, and then he jumps over it, and then, of course, it, it nullifies my entire uh, demonstration. So. <laughs> It's 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 a solid game, man. I can't argue with it. I can't. I would I would definitely not sit here and say this game sucks, uh, except for the fact that it's just skellies. But again, it's a dollar. It's a dollar, man. It's multiplayer. You can co-op this mess. Oh, that sh she's the worst. She's the worst. Ouch. Good to know, though, I only have, I can't just keep putting quarters in. 
now that I'm already through an apple. Tasty. tasty. Oh, ooh, tasty. Really, girl? Mmm. You're dead, right? No, you're not. Standard beat him up and done well, done quite well. 80 MSP, game's been out for a little while. It's not brand new or anything, it's not gonna be shiny new, but it's better than some of the games we played on the show, man, seriously. Damn it, Top Hat. Top Hat, you're a dick. God, I almost wanna keep going, but we'll go for a little bit while longer. How's that? Mushroom. Oh, wow, I'm way faster with this thing. Heavy attack, heavy attack, heavy attack. Nope, we're not. Ah. Damn it. Yeah, the Lily, I think it's it's the uh, the female skeletons. Those ones are the hardest. I can deal with Top Hat running around like an idiot. But the rest, no, it's too much. All right. Come on. God, the combat's so good, it pisses me off. It pisses me off that all I've seen is skellies. Now, I haven't seen a, a combo system. Now, if there was a combo system, this game would be amazing. It would be like, oh, it's just, just the the holy grail, the, 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 the game that nobody would have probably like thought to even look twice at because of, you know, uh, usually when you, when you see a game again like this, like I've, I'm beating it to death, but you know, you don't always get the full experience um, that you want. But damn, just shocked at how good it is. Uh oh, I just hit, I just ate something that was bad, but it's okay, it's out of my system, looks like. Come on, closer. Grab, grab. Knee in the nuts. Uh slide right past you several times. I'm guessing that actually does something else. Oh no, no, it does exactly what it's supposed to do. <laughs> Dilly. Okay, that didn't work out. Also, it'd be nice if there was like weapons for me to pick up. I realized I got my baton, which is great. The axe is my primary weapon. Uh, and then of course I could kick, so you have a couple abilities and whatnot, but damn it, top hat every time! God, it's upgrading yourself past Lily. Oh, here we go. Again! What a dick! Oh, nice. There we go, okay. Alright, so while while I'm doing this, I'm a little quiet, and the reason why is because I want I, I I do all these shows in real time, right? There's no other way for me to Oh, that thing killed me. <laughs> Uh, there's actually no other feasible way of me able, to, me be able to knock out a daily show unless I were to do it in real time. Plus, it wouldn't be quite as fun. Uh, and it's good practice. Oh, here we go. Yeah, bring it, bring it. Right when I pick up the freaking up. Oh no, I got, I got knocked out. Okay. But what I've been doing is uh, on the other screen is I'm look, I'm looking up to see what. Uh, what the deal is with this game? Like, what, like, why, why this, why that, right? Just to see what other people's opinions are. Uh, and I just pulled up a, a review on xbl-indiverse.blogspot.com. There's a reason why your site didn't take off, guy, because that that that's an absurd name. Um, but dunk on him. Ah, oh, damn it. But he even says in his critique, or he, or him, him or her, I'm not sure which. Um, the first line says, solo play is too hard. And that's exactly what I pointed out right at the beginning of this, uh, of this Indie for Breakfast, was that the solo play, it's, there's, it's possible that the game is not tuned. Oh, oh great, yeah, reverse, reverse everything. Um, 
it's not tuned for single player because multiplayer is available. Otherwise, multiplayer would be too easy. So it's, it, this happens a lot. You know, this isn't a AAA title. It's not developed by people who are testing and writing code and all this stuff, like, like really, really, really crazy amounts of code in order to have the game actually make adjustments uh, in gameplay based off of your, damn it, again, again. Okay, I'll take the money. Can't, I can't because of my controls are backwards. Punch him in the face, punch him in the face. Yeah, that's enough, come on, come on, come on. But anyways, even he says solo play is too hard, so good to know I'm not the only one that finds it difficult. Oh, kick you in the nuts, or, or whatever. The bones! A top hat. Okay, getting close to what I, I believe might be the end here. Alright, see if I can actually get past this part without sacrificing too much more life. Damn it. <sighs> in true, in true beat-em-up format too. You get close to the edge, you're gonna get hit by something you can't see. It's like every other beat-em-up, it's like that. Damn. All right, we're gonna have to, oh, Jesus. Yes, continue. Nothing I picked up has given me health so far. I mean, I, it's possible one of those things gave me health, but... Oh, that one did. Okay, good. That was the apple. The apple gives me health. Good. I didn't notice before because I was, I think I was already full health or surrounded by monsters or skellies or something. I have no idea which. But here we go. Now we're approaching the end of the level. Damn it. Come on, dude. Come on. Just, get, just let me finish the end of the level here. I'm not picking up the other thing. Stage clear. All right. Please be something other than skeletons. Oh god, I'm falling into a hole. Oh Jesus. Right, what did she say? What did she say right down here? Um <laughs> uh, so I've landed in a deep hole. More skellies! <laughs> uh, okay, so monster variation. Uh, it doesn't seem to really be a whole lot of that. But at least level there's plenty. Oh no, I take that back! All of a sudden it's changed. We do have something for my low kick to actually uh Oh man, I'm getting my ass kicked. Damn. So there, I, I, that, I'm so happy that we actually came back and went to hit this point, because now we know that Mr. Grubbs is indeed in, damn, and it's difficult. In the game. God, let's just get my ass kicked. Oh my God, it's a fat Mr. Grubbs. Damn. <laughs> Oh, nice. You can provoke him. Ah, no double jump. <laughs> Come on, do something. There we go. Grub. The small ones don't seem to do much. Uh, besides, be really, really annoying. Grubbling. Apple. Apple. Nice. Money. God, oh god, oh god, oh god. I'm glad that it does damage to others. I wish. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. T top hat! Damn it. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm just getting served by grubs left and right. Like no health. Yeah, and that there it is right there. <laughs> of course now Lily's back. I like that they have names. I can like call them by their names. Like it shows up. It's not just nameless mob. Kinda gives them a little bit of personality, I guess. I guess. I think this is my last continue. Come here, wait, I need you. Don't be dead, don't be dead. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. She's gonna freaking high kick me, I know it. Apple. Tasty. Yeah, take that, Lily. Okay, grub. Yeah, juked. Come on, come on, let's 
Ezio. We have plenty of time. Well, we had plenty of time to go through twice. I'm really happy that we did. Because just the fact that there are more mobs, they're adding mobs, is just uh, definitely raises the bar already. And I think this might be it. Uh, I don't know if it counts one as I have another life or if this is my last life. There we go. Now we're at the end. More mobs. Same, same concept. Oh, but this time with... Oh! Please, only got one more life. Damn it! <laughs> Alright, so one means that is my last. So there you go, guys. That is Andy for Breakfast. The in the incidents of Dreamy Vale Church. <sighs> Surprisingly good. Definitely not reject material at all. This is a good game. 80 MSP. It's freaking hard. Uh, I'm sure that you could probably solo with some practice and whatnot, like any good game. Uh, like any yeah, any decent game that offers challenge. Uh, but uh, yeah, I mean, pick it up, play it with a friend. And uh, see if you get through uh, and just, you know, make sure you don't play it in front of your, you know, over jealous uh, or <laughs> controlling girlfriend and you'll be all right. <laughs> Mike BK Phony, check this game out in the game markets for, uh, <laughs> for ADMSP, $1. And we'll see you guys later.